bigger map back again. Twice in a night, I'm waiting for my stuffed stuffed uh, mushrooms to cook or stuffed with crab meat. Uh, it's uh, five of twelve, and I gotta be some. I gotta get up at five, so quick. But I can't go to sleep with an empty gut. Uh, this time I got tickets. I got some pretty cool shit. Let's see. Uh, real quick. Military pens. Military pens. Four bucks. Uh, you know, at auction. I buy everything at auction. I go to yard sales a little bit, but those are picked over. So these two pens right here. The World War Two. Pens, four bucks. Um, I don't know if they work. I got them for somebody else. Uh, so let's see. I got this for them also. M1. It's actually an M14 casing. 14 bucks. It's a big old shell casing. World War II. I don't know if you can read that. Stamped on the primer, 1945. It says uh, 105 millimeter. Um, 14. Let's get these other prints here. I think it was from a shell field. Let's see. Yeah, ammo lot, whatever. Shell M2, M2A1, and M3. We could uh, you know. Should have had a different gun, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know nothing about it. Ah, uh, it's big part, you know. It's got some weight to it. So, uh, 14 bucks. I mean, you're about half there in scrap for that, uh, you know, the copper, old red brass. You know, the brass ain't like it used to be. They mixed it with so much shit. It's yellow brass. This old stuff, you get yellow brass for it. But I ain't scrapping it. I got that for somebody. Just wanted to show you how. Okay, now where's that ticket? Yeah, that was 14 bucks. Um, real quick, four bucks. Probably got ripped on this one. Kind of got got caught up in this. four bucks. Tops micro card set sealed. Yeah, never opened. It's a whole set, 792 cards. They're really tiny little ones. Complete 91 set. 192 cards. You know, there's not much good in there. I think, uh, Chipper Jones rookie would be in there. If it's like mint, uh, if it grades high, but if you gotta open it, whatever, they uh, just stash it up. I don't know, sell it out. I shouldn't have bought it. Shit. Uh, now these were alright. Baseball cards. I have my finger shading it. Baseball cards, one lot. I bid it up to 32. What they did is they put all these baseball cards out on the table in stacks. And there was this little teeny stack, but I already knew what I wanted ahead of time. The other ones were shit. They were just regular mid 90s cards wrapped up in rubber bands, big stacks like this. Nobody wants that crap. And they had this one little stack there. It was actually two stacks. They had the red ones and the blue ones separated. And they're in plastic, they're like mint condition. They're uh, 1965, um, 1965 tops embossed uh, cards. They got a lot of good ones in here. See the back side? I'll see what the back side looks like first. So you got card 7. Card 41, blah, 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 blah. you know, they all look the same on the back. But I'll go through them one by one and show how. These are good. Now, let's see, I can't go one by one. There's a lot of doubles. You got Ron Hunt. You know, the edges are crispy. No foil to mess up. Ron Hunt. Ed Matthews. Uh, another Ed Matthews, John Callison. Now these are all in plastic and mint condition. 
Woody McMillan. Uh, this one's got a little edge wear. Ron Fairley. Uh, Bob Shaw. Al McBean. Walt Bond. Bob Espermonte. Ken Boyer. Another is Rob Fairley. Did we pass him already? I think we doubles it out. Jim Maloney. Tony Davis. You know, like I said, the Christy Nunn. Lee May. Billy Williams. A little off center. Another Lee May. You know, they're in the plastic. Take one up and show you. I've got a little edge thing there, but I didn't mean pretty badass. Let me put it back. Uh, Johnny Romano. Alkaline. 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 Jim Bunning. Leon Wagner. So there's the money card right there. Mickey Mantle. That's a great shape. Slightly off center. The edges are sharp as hell. Razor sharp. The foil ain't all wear worn in the front. I see shitty ones getting like 30, 40 bucks. Jim Bunning. Jim King Bill Freehand Earl Beatty Leon Wagner Another Earl Bailey Max Elvis Oh here we go more Reds uh, another Bob Astromont hey, that's a double another Ernie Banks and a little Tim McCarver. So, yeah. All these for one money, um, $32. Can't go wrong with that. You gotta make some money. There's gotta be some move on that balance, especially in these discontents. Maybe not in this market. You know, people ain't paying shit for nothing like that. So, uh, maybe it's best to stash them off. I don't know. Maybe so. So, what else we got? Oh, that'd be it. That's it. My shit. I can smell they're done. Uh, next video I'll do some other guy would be records. 45 bucks. Uh, three lots of $2, six bucks. Uh, I collect records. I got a lot of records. Too many to even make videos of. I have almost 50,000 records. I collect rare 45s. My other account is Game Icy or Maddie Game. I don't know. I have a link to it. My, I upload some records. I used to sell them. I don't sell them anymore. I'm saving them. So people got money. People get their jobs back and start spending money like they used to. I'm not giving shit away for free. Especially a record if it's six bucks. I'm not going to pack, ship, buy the fucking shit, and this and that, and go to post office for six bucks. They might, you know, I might have just thrown the trash for that kind of money. So, uh, when people get their jobs back, and they start spending money, then I'll start selling stuff again. Other than that, I'm putting junk on his back. I don't care. I got enough money to keep buying. Just as long as I get, uh, enough money to buy some more shit, because I'm out of work too. I'm, I've been a union sprinkler fitter for 20 years. And uh, I'm sitting home, it's fucked up, but whatever, thanks for watching.